and this EcoFlow Delta recharge my Tesla? Well, the answer is no, it cannot. So, unfortunately, due to the grounding issue that the Tesla would require a ground be, to be able to recharge. So let me show you. So this is AC enabled. I have the wall outlet, uh, wall charger connected in the back. This is the Tesla Model 3 charger. And any, as you can see, it's blinking red, right? That's not a good sign. And this opens the charging port. I plug it in. It bips. The car bips a little bit and this blinks red again. And if you take a look at the output, it shows zero. Okay, let's go to the car and see what happens. Well, it says charging stopped. My battery is at 38%. And this is the warning, unable to charge. Then I press that icon, I get a notification here it says, unable to charge with mobile connector due to inadequate outlet grounding. Try a different outlet. So, no, it cannot recharge my Tesla. That's for sure. So I found it interesting because um, in the official video commercial of this product, it says uh, a, a guy pulled out this battery bank from his trunk, then started recharging his Tesla Mo Model S. So I guess it may work for Model S. I don't know. I don't have one. So my conclusion is that it is a great power bank. It would be able to run all the all my power tools like table saw and miter saw. But it should not be able to uh, charge my Tesla. However, the AC power power outlets are rated as um, one thousand eight hundred watts. Uh, which is, you know, you should be able to power anything with this uh, power bank, all the home appliances, fridge, all these, um, you know, anything in your house, but not the Tesla. It would require a proper grounding, which this unit does not have. So I'm going to unplug. And of course, it will not damage my car for sure. So I better stick to the traditional, uh, the thing is, let me put this down, unplug. Let me power off first. Okay, uh, power off. And I would have to use the 240 watts. Let me put my phone down. So the adapter has to be this guy from 240 watt panel, you know, uh, outlet that I built myself with the, it has a 50 amps or 60 amps break, breaker. Um, so the model 3 i think it's 50 amps model 3 can uh, draw a maximum of um i believe uh 32 amps max therefore this isn't a viable solution for me although i have 200 flexible solar panel hooked up and recharge this thing to 90 percent and I topped it off this morning to 100 percent it still won't do the job. Yeah, unfortunately, due to the lack of grounding. So. Max, 32 amps, yes. So I'm gonna recharge my Tesla today with the 
with the wall outlet uh, back to maybe 80%. I don't drive that much um, due to the pandemic. Well, guess that's it. <clears throat>